Welcome to Trading How to YouTube channel. In this video, we will see how we can transfer funds to our Fires trading account. Here I have logged into my account using Fires web and uh, here in this Fires web, we can see an option called as fund transfer. We have to click on that. It will open up another window where we can add the funds. We can straight away see the balance available and then we can uh, add the funds. Here for the demonstration purpose, I'm going to enter 500 here. And after that, we can see that we have two options. One is by using the UPI method. Another one is by using the net banking. If you choose net banking, then you have to pay the extra charge. That is 10 rupees plus GST. Whatever the charge is there, it will be displayed here. Now I'm going to go to UPI because it is free. And also for this method, primary is selected. Um, they have uh, two different payment gateways. We will not change anything in here. And then we can see our bank account details displayed in here. It is the same account that we have provided while opening the account. Then to transfer the amount, we can enter the UPI ID. I'm going to enter my UPI ID in here. And after that, I'm going to click on add funds. Now it will send a request for payment to your uh, UPI account. What you have to do is you have to approve your payment. Once you approve the payment in the UPI app, it will say transaction completed successfully. And also it will display a reference ID. If you want, you can uh, make a note of that. And after that, we can click on the back to my funds button. It will take us to uh, add funds section and we can see the balance that is available now. It should display the updated balance. Now in the Fires web interface, if I open up the dashboard and if I go to funds, the amount is not reflected. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to refresh this uh, interface. And once I do that, now if I go back to the funds, I can see the updated amount. So this is it guys. This is how we can add funds to the Fires trading account. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you don't like it, hit the dislike button. And if you want to say something, then write that in the comment box. For more videos like this, do subscribe to the channel.